All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is my, my honor, my pleasure to introduce today's speaker. This gentleman, uh, Dr. Anthony Stroman, is a man of God. He's a man of faith. He's a man of integrity. Many of you know him through his through his relationship with the church and the body of Christ. He travels throughout the country and throughout the world, uh, showing people how to get themselves together financially, physically, emotionally, as well as financially in some other areas. Uh, he's going to share some information with you. It's called the Health Success Triangle Movement. Uh, again, I want to say it's an honor to know him. We've actually known each other for, for let's say, many, many years. And again, I, there's not not too many people I would give a, this kind of honor, but this individual is, a again, not only a man of faith and man of God, but he is a man of integrity, doing some phenomenal things, helping people heal in a lot of ways. So please help me introduce and bring to the front, for those of you who don't know him, Mr. Dr. Anthony Stroman. Hey, Derek, can you hear me, sir? Yes, we can hear you loud and clear, brother. Excellent. Hey, Derek, thank you. Thank you so very much, my brother, for that warm introduction. We appreciate you so, so very much. Guys, we're going to jump right in, give you a quick little bio about myself very quickly, because we have a lot of information that we're going to give you in a very short period of time. This event is all about you. You guys are the star of the show. We are the messengers, but it's about you. Okay. The first thing is I've been in health and wellness for almost 30 years. It's been a passion for mine for a long time. Number two, I've been in financial education even longer than that. So one day, you know how God is, right? He came to me and told me, because I was so passionate about these two things, to put them together because the body of Christ is suffering in those two areas. Now, whatever we say today, everything we say is in love, no condemnation at all. What I love about a brand new day is that it's a brand new day. The past is behind you. This can be happy new year for all of you if you receive and execute what we're gonna talk about today. So it's all about the church community, guys. That's what it's all about. We wanna help a million people, okay? This is not a small assignment. We're gonna help a million people. We'll be doing some things internationally. You'll hear that at another time. But that's pretty much my background, those two areas. And so I can put them together and we form what we call a dream team of experts in those areas. The first phase of our goal is to help 500 churches to have victory in these areas. So we're gonna break down, and you see the slides really quickly, these slides we're gonna go over very quickly. So I wanna welcome you again to this health success triangle. Now, what this really is, my friend, is three John two. The success triangle is three John two. Beloved, I wish above all things, what's left out of all, nothing that you will be in health. We're going to talk about that. That's the majority of what we're going to talk about. 98% is going to be about your health. And then he wants your soul to prosper. I call it masculine headquarters. So the three things I'm going to talk about briefly, you must master headquarters. Guys, here's what I realized in life. I've worked with many, many churches around the country, a lot of pastors, bishops, apostles, the whole nine yards. What I've observed if you don't master headquarters, everything that I'm going to say and what Mr. Hawkins is going to say is not going to make any difference if you don't master headquarters. Whether you're going to be happy or sad is headquarters. Whether you're going to have victory or defeat is headquarters. Whether if you're going to prosper in every area is headquarters. If you want to live a prosperous life, happy life, whatever, sadness, it don't matter. Everything is about mastering headquarters. And what has happened, we've let the world get into the church system. And we're thinking too much like the world. And this is why we have so many people in the church that are being defeated, and they got the number one success book in the world, which is the Bible. They're reading it, but it's not getting through for some reason. The roots are not deep enough. If it's surface, guys, you're not going to have victory over this enemy we all often call the devil, right? So I'll briefly talk about mastering headquarters because, again, if you don't get that straight, nothing else matters. Number two, we're going to deal with your billion-dollar temple. It is amazing. Guys, let me just share something with you. The greatest investment is not the stock, up, stock market. It's not real estate. The greatest investment besides your spirit, man, is your billion-dollar temple. Once you make that paradigm shift, you begin to change your behavior because I don't care what you tell me, it's based on your behavior. Okay, you can say anything to me you want, but I'm watching your behavior. That's the proof that you really receive what we're going to talk about today and what you heard in the past. It is a billion dollar temple. 
And I understand the challenge because the world system have conditioned program us for so many years to abuse our bodies. The bad health has become normal in the church. That's not normal, my friends. It is abnormal to have this much sickness and disease in churches. Again, no condemnation. If you didn't know, that's okay. That's why we're here to educate you about this. Because I go to churches, 60% got serious chronic disease. Something is wrong with that picture. They're singing the songs, praising worship. They're doing all those things, reading about, and they're sincere. But they're still sincere and de destructive in their health and in their finances. Something is wrong with that. We have to disrupt what we're thinking right now because it's not working. And all of you belong to wonderful churches. We're just providing a little education. Okay, the third area of the triangle is to destroy debt. Folks, do you understand that debt can destroy your health? And the other thing that's an epidemic, I won't have time to unpack this, was having a legacy document. It's so amazing how many church people I know by the millions, they don't have legacy documents in place. We're gonna deal with these things because again, they're all tied into this crusade of this triangle. And I'm saying to you right now, if you get serious about this triangle, mastering headquarters, mastering your billion dollar temple, and mastering your finances, it's management. I'm not talking about being a multi-millionaire. I'm talking about simple stewardship and management. So let's talk about the first thing very quickly. Headquarters, that powerful computer. When you came into planet Earth, the challenge is you didn't have a manual. Six inches, six inches between your ears, you didn't have a manual. And this is the challenge, folks, because you didn't have a manual about taking care of your headquarters. Okay? Now, I'm going to give you some principles that I teach all over the place. A few. Just a few. Nothing changes until your mind changes. You can change your house, change your car, change your, your state, change your zip. It don't matter. Nothing changes until your mind changes. I don't care how much you jump and shout and get excited, which we should, but nothing changes until your mind changes. In the body of Christ, we have too much perspiration. We need some information. Now, this debt thing that I talked about briefly, because debt gives you instant pleasure, but long-term pain. It gives you instant pleasure and long-term pain. It's time to get out of that status, guys. So mind management, you got to bulletproof your mind, folks, every day. You got to be a drill sergeant to protect your mind from the in negative environments out there. Every thought has a life or death component attached to it. Mental drill sergeant, that's why I have no bad days. Every day I have a good, I have bad moments sometimes, but guess what, I have no bad days because I'm a spiritual computer programmer. I program myself every day, seven days a week, no bad days. Challenges, yes, but guess what? I'm a spiritual computer programmer. The most difficult project in the world is the reconstruction of the human mind. This is, this is a deal. I mean, this is so challenging. You think about the children of Israel, all what they saw, those miracles. Miracles you think change people? Come on now. So whatever you confess, you will digest. Whatever you confess, you will digest. You got to be your own weather reporter, folks. Practice thinking like God, little G. This don't come from Dr. Stroman, Ephesians 5.1. Be an imitator, not an imitation of God. Okay, this is the word. This is not me. I'm just a reporter. You were born to live a victorious life, guys. It's time to get started right now. It is your mind that keeps you small. That's the only thing that keeps you small. The most powerful force on earth is the will of man. And we have no control over that. God doesn't even interfere with that. You know how powerful that is. It is your will. So we have to make sure that we're free from what I call unbelief attacks. The mind. I believe many people in churches across the country, the reason why they're living defeated lives because it's an incomplete download. They haven't downloaded this stuff. They don't have the roots. 90% of people are addicted to wrong thinking. I wish they came up with a technology called a negative meter. Every time you say something negative, it goes off, okay? You rise or fall based on your belief system, okay? Whatever you do, it's your belief system. So I want all of you to catch a win faction because God designed you to win. You wasn't designed to be defeated. You're designed to win. That's, that's your original design. So let's get back to your original design. That's who you are. Now, mastery, the key to freedom is mastery over headquarters. Information does not bring transformation. Conversion does. You don't get what you want in life. You get your standards. You do not get what you want in life. You get your standards. 
Now that's headquarters, a few things about headquarters. The next thing, which is star of the show. Let's talk about your billion dollar temple. Oh my God. Here we go. Many of this stuff is not your fault because guys, the world system is so trickery. They have used food as a weapon of mass destruction to kill God's people for years, and we have no idea how they're doing it. I'm here to reveal it to you so you can protect yourself. Guys, you don't have to be perfect. I'm going to bring this back up again. You don't have to be perfect. But I teach generational health. I know you heard about generational wealth. That's fine. But I teach generational health. Every decision that you make only doesn't only affect you. It affects your household. Guys, you got to set your kids up and your grandkids you don't want them to have the cancer, diabetes, obesity, all these things. That's an epidemic. It's up to us to do that, guys. Stop being an automatic believer. You got to take charge. And it starts with taking charge of headquarters, right? Now, also, we're going to talk briefly about the power of prevention. This is one of my main deals when I'm speaking at churches. Folks, if we adopt the mentality of prevention, we wouldn't have all the sickness. I hope you caught that. Prevention is less expensive and less painful. Prevention and restoration. I don't care what your health situation is. I got good news for you. It can be turned around if you become intentional and focused. Learn the power of spiritual and natural laws. This is a major issue in the body of Christ. We know about spiritual laws. You can have 10 Bibles and still live defeated lives in your health. Yes, you heard me correctly. I didn't stutter. Because we have, many people have ignored natural laws. If you violate a, the law, you don't violate the law. They violate you. When you violate health laws, folks, Galatians kicks in. What have you so will reap? I feel good. I have no medication. I thank God for that. Not because I'm special. It's just that I specialize because I need to be around a long time because I have a lot to do for the kingdom. I'm not going to shorten my life by 40 years because of not knowing because of a lack of knowledge. But a lot of you are just straight up disobedience, if I can be so kind. God is not going to bless disobedience when it comes to taking care of your health. So you're responsible for this billion-dollar temple, right? So you got to know health laws. If you want to be healthy, you got to study health. You want to be happy, study joy. Folks, you got to make it a study. It's not automatic. Next thing, the power of stem cell technology and superior hydration. This is going to be the main concentration on this class today. My dear partner will hit you with the technology on stem cells. I will briefly talk about the power of hydration. Let me say this before I introduce my dear friend. Let me say this to all of you. We need education. We need strategic planning and management. You don't hear teachings in pulpits about management, but you must understand if you don't manage your life, your life will be out of control. And that's why so many people, the top prayer requests in churches across the nation, ever since I've been a believer, health and finances across the board. Why is that? And we got the number one book in the world. Something is wrong, and we're here to correct that with education. Now, God gave us five health defense systems. Get this, everybody. God gave us five health defense systems. The first one is your blood vessels. We call it angiogenesis. The second thing is your immune system. The third thing is your DNA. The fourth is your microbiome. But there's one out of the five that affects the other four, and that is the power of your stem cells. Folks, we got good news for you. If you get this and receive it and take action, your life is about to change if you take action. See, the Bible's about a book of ifs. If you do, if you're willing and obedient, it's an if book. If you do it, we have no control over that. I've already prayed about this class today because if one person get it, this message will not be in vain. So let me give you what I believe the church needs to learn. Number one, I believe the church needs to learn how to bake a health prosperity cake. You never heard that before, a health prosperity cake. You know, that's a recipe. It's a recipe, right? So let me give you my simple recipe before I pass the baton to my dear brother. Number one. I recommend that you confess the word of God every day over your billion dollar temple. Guys, I talk to my heart, my liver, my digestive system, my immune system, my cells, my pancreas, kidney, every day. I speak over my body every day. Number two, eat mostly live food for a live body. 
processed food for a processed body. Folks, okay, let's go with the 80-20 rule. You don't have to be perfect. 80% eat like a king and a queen, and then 20% you want to eat like a peasant? That's okay. But 80-20 rule, you don't have to be perfect. Don't be in bondage about that. But we're not eating like kings and queens. We need to eat like that. If you want to, that's what he, call, he calls you, all these wonderful things in the word. Don't you know who you are? Do you know your identity? That you're fearfully and wonderfully made? You're the best he's ever made? Why don't we act like that? Number three, you need to supplement. Guys, the environment is not the same. The soils are not the same. You got to supplement. That's an additional insurance if you want to live a long, healthy life. If you want to have canes and and breaking down and, and, and suffering and all of that, keep me out of the loop because I got something to do with it. You want to supplement, guys, because everything is, even in organic food, everything is not in it. Supplement is an additional insurance. But guess what? You need superior water. I am a certified hydration specialist. I teach this, folks. I'm telling you right now, I'll break it down later on. Superior water for superior billion-dollar temple. Okay, I know some of you thinking, well, Dr. Stroman, I don't like water. Let me be so kind. God is the manufacturer. He said your body's designed for water. Let's get out of our feelings and get into some wisdom and intellect. I don't like water. Well, guess what? God is the manufacturer. He said water. Coca-Cola wants you to believe that you want to drink Coke. Let me leave that alone. Number four, you got to exercise, folks. When your body moves, your brain grooves. Guys, you must exercise. Number five, here's the good part. You must wear what my partner is going to talk about right now, this amazing, incredible X39 stem cell patch every single day. Okay, so I got two scriptures at the bottom. Write them down. Genesis 6-3, I'm part of the 120 Club. You listen to CDC. That's your message? Okay, I'm with Genesis 6-3. Psalms 91-16, live a long, satisfied life. I'm with that. Okay, that's what I meant. And I want all of you to consider thinking that way. Stop thinking that you're supposed to leave here in a short period of time and live in sickness and disease. Jesus didn't die for that. Something is wrong. So now let me do this. Get out of the way. I'm bringing on my brother like no other, Mr. Derek Hawkins. He's going to talk about these patches. And he's going to show you also a, two powerful testimonies about how powerful these patches are. My dear brother, come to the forefront. My brother, Mr. Derek Hawkins. Yes, sir. Dr. Stroman, thank you for that incredible introduction. Can you hear me in terms of a sound check? Yes, sir. Sounds good. Great. Well, thank you for setting the stage for what I'm going to talk about. You make my job very easy. Uh, Dr. Stroman, as he you know, did, talked about uh, stem cell patches and, and important. So my question to you is, have you been patched yet? And if you have not been patched yet, we guarantee you by the end of this call, you will be running to the person that invited you to get the, your hands on these patches because again, it's part of what he called that triangle, you know, the, the physical part of it. So let me tell you about this patch. Now, this is something that I didn't know. In fact, many of you may not know this. You go to your doctors and uh, did you know that the fewer stem cells you have, the faster you age and the slower you heal? Hundreds of millions of people are experiencing symptoms of aging daily and at, at age 30, only half of your stem cells are active. And by the time you turn 60, you lose almost all your stem cell activity. Now, that's important to you because with your stem cell, when you think about it, when you're a child, you get hurt, you get a scratch, you get a bruise, or you break something, you heal very quickly. That's because you have active stem cells. By the time you get 60, again, if you have those same injuries, you get scratched, or you, you fall and hurt, those injuries become permanent lifestyles that people get used to. Let me talk about this patch. Let me first talk about the man, the man who developed it. His name is David Schmidt. He's the CEO and inventor of this incredible patch. He has over 180 patents. I have to update this slide because it says 130, but he's up to 180 patents. He's a scientist and inventor. He specializes in age reversing. Uh, again, in 2008, David actually focused his attention on uh, stem cell research. That's important because, again, that's what we're talking about. He has a recent patent. A patent in fact, it took him over 10 years and $4.5 million to bring it to market. He was first introduced to this industry over 20 years ago when he was contracted by the Navy SEALs to develop a patch that will allow them to stay alert for more than 30 hours. Now, rather than me explaining to you how this patch works and the benefits of it, I'm going to have you hear directly from David Schmidt. I'm going to play a short three-minute video. He's going to tell you about this patch, how it works. And on the other side of that three-minute video, I'm going to come back and simplify it and break it down even further. So if you got a pen and pad, take some notes, listen very closely and intently. You're going to hear definitely from David Schmidt, and you're going to know that he not only is a man of faith, he's a man that has a mission to help millions of people heal. So sit back and relax, and I'll see you on the other side of this three-minute video.
please share with us how the amazing X39 technology works. We got a lot of brand partners that are, that are brand new, so they really want to hear from you. And then we got some highly sophisticated, educated doctors in the room, so kind of relate to all of them how this technology works. Yeah, so the first thing to understand, I suppose, is that um, our bodies are based on light as a form of communication. We have a bioelectrical system in our body, uh, which is all based on uh, math and geometry. And if we can understand what this biological code is, uh, we can do some really remarkable things with it. So uh, the current direction of my research is looking at species that are immortal and looking at codes, that, the mathematical codes that we find in the Bible and mathematical codes that we find in nature, uh, which I now think of as being uh, God's fingerprint. Um, and we can use this information to support the body's natural healing systems in ways that haven't been available before. So with the patches, uh, which is one of many different technologies that we'll come out with. I know we'll probably talk a little bit about what's in, what's in store for the future, uh, which is incredibly exciting. Uh, but on the patches, because this is our foundational technology and our foundational products, um, they stimulate the skin with a blend of different wavelengths of light that are modulated to contain information. So what does this mean? If we think of laser communications, which have been around for many, many decades now. Uh, and that's how fiber optics work. We're going to take a laser, we modulate the light to contain information, and then at the receiving end, that light is unpacked and decoded, and now we can hear voice or see video. So the human body essentially works the same way, meaning that um, light is emitted from the cells. And actually, how light is emitted from the cells is an incredibly fascinating subject uh, because it's, it's coming from the DNA and the hydrogen bonds in the DNA. And that light emission has actually come from the spiritual realm, you might say. Um, but what this all means is that in the thousands and thousands of different biochemical reactions that are occurring at any one time, there are pulses of coherent, laser-like light that is emitted from the DNA, emitted from the cells, and this orchestrates and initiates the changing biochemical environment in the cell. So what this means is that now, uh, through normal course of aging, our glutathione or our copper peptide levels would decrease. But if we know the code where we can stimulate the skin and communicate with the body and say, hey, I'd like to increase those copper peptide levels, and I, I want to improve the activity of the stem cells in the body. If we know that code, then it's nothing more complicated than stimulating the skin with those wavelengths of light to instruct the cells to elevate the copper peptide. And the exciting thing is that that's only the beginning. What we can do uh, with light-based technology is nothing short of extraordinary. Please share. Wow, I heard you heard and listened to him very carefully. And if you cannot tell, David Schmidt is a man of faith. He mentioned mathematical codes that are found in nature and in the Bible. He talked about having God's fingerprint on this thing. So it's no coincidence that he is the person who identified it. But he mentioned something in his video. He said something about copper peptide. Copper peptide is really what's the science behind it because it was discovered back in 1973 by a scientist named Lauren Picard that if you can figure out a way to activate your copper peptides, you will actually stimulate your stem cells because the patch does not have any stem cells in it. It basically has uh, reflects light back inward. And just to summarize what David just shared, uh, it's just like we get vitamin D. When you go onto the sunlight, you get vitamin D not from the sun, but certain frequencies of light from the sun when it hits your body it activates your copper peptide. And once your copper peptides are activated, guess what? It stimulates your stem cells. Once your stem cells are stimulated, all kinds of things starts to happen. Uh, I'm just going to read a quote from the book that was put written by Lauren Picard. He said, I was more successful than I had ever imagined in discovering a human molecule that helps to turn back the clock on many types of aging. 
And during the course of him trying to find which protein would work, there are literally hundreds of proteins that he did research on. He could not figure out which one would work. And you know what he did? He went and prayed about it. And it was led back to copper peptide. So this is incredible. Not only is David Schmidt a man of faith, so was Lauren Picard. So it's no, this is not irony. It's actually destiny. Now I'm going to talk a little bit about the patent again, for those of you who want some facts. This is uh, from the patent. And understand you cannot get a patent unless you have something that literally works. And just reading some of what it says in this patent, as a result of the embodiments as we, of, of the using the, the patches, you get elevating copper peptide. It includes the L activation of stem cells, improvements in energy, elevation of antioxidants, reduction in inflammation, management of pain, improvements in stamina, elevation of collagen protein of production, and improved wound healing. If you were to go to a restaurant for healing and all of these things on the menu, I would get everything on the menu because that is the bottom line and the benefit of using this patch. Now, here's actually some actual facts. This is actually a scan or what you call a topography of a 77-year-old woman's brain. In the far left, you see a lot of reddish orange area that represent inflammation in the brain. She had a lack of brain coherence. And after wearing the patch in the third week, session two, she came back and you notice the reddish orange area is gone. There's no more inflammation. There's improved brain coherence. And in session three, you notice you see more yellows and greens and more cooling, which represents complete turnaround, better brain coherence within six weeks. So again, and this brain, even though it's a brain scan, I want you to think of the rest of your body. This could be your liver. It could be your heart. It could be your collagen. It could be your joints. It could be any part of your body because we are made of stem cell. So everybody needs these patches. How does the X39 patch works? It's basically a form, a proprietary form of phototherapy. Uh, this is nothing new. Thousands of years ago, uh, back in the Greek time, they actually used different shades of glass, different colors, greens, yellow, blues, to do different things to stimulate the body. Again, it's a patent in nanocrystal technology. It's simply uh, crystals, more, they're organic crystals that are, again, that reflect light at a certain wavelength. And once it reflects that light, it activates the copper peptides, which in turn activates your stem cells. It is non-transdermal, which means it doesn't penetrate the skin. There are no drugs or chemicals or stimulants, unlike what we get from our pharmaceuticals and recommend for many doctors. Uh, it's non-invasive, so it's, a, it's very, very, very beneficial to use. <clears throat> now, just as a, a disclaimer, LifeWay products are not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent any disease or medical condition. Now, here are the benefits of the X39 patch. You get increased strength, reduced inflammation, increased stamina energy and vitality, mental clarity, uh, restored muscle or skeletal condition, improvement of sleep, improvement of skin appearance. I've, I've actually experienced several of these benefits of using the patch. Again, you can achieve optimal health in a state of complete physical, mental, and social well-being by the use of these patches. Now, how do you wear the patch and then what and, and what are the benefits of it? Well, in the first few days, 4,000 genes begin to reset. So there's some people that will use this patch and they will actually notice some activation. They will notice some things right away. Uh, again, it's a smart patch. So what it does, it identifies what your body needs first or what, what needs the most. So uh, even though you might be looking for an immediate uh, relief in some area, it may be working on something that you may not be aware of. So when the 4,000 genes begin to reset, and just by comparison, they said if you drink enough red wine, uh, you would actually uh, activate two of your genes. That's because there's an ingredient called resveratrol which is basically this, the extract of a, a grape seed uh, that actually allows that to happen. So imagine two versus 4,000. So you can imagine what starts to happen. So things start to happen very quickly. Now, within six weeks, your brain becomes balanced, as I showed you with the topography of the 77-year-old woman's brain. You can see the balance in six weeks. Within three months, your collagen is increased. That means that's important for people that are athletes, people that work in construction, people in fields where they on their feet a lot because your collagen is that cushion between your joints. It also helps you with the tightening of your skin. Uh, so you're going to see some tremendous benefits from that as well. Within six months, your heart reverses in age. Many people have used the patch. We have thousands of testimonies where individuals have gone to a doctor, got a, a checkup, go back six months later, and they look at them like they, they reversed in age. A 60-year-old person has the age of a 40-year-old. That's typical of what happens with people that use it. Again, it has a cumulative effect. So the longer you wear the patch, the more benefits you see. And it's not anti-aging. It is actually age-reversing. And that is a quote from David Schmidt, the inventor of this patch. Now, how do you wear this patch? Very simple. You wear the patch for 12 hours on. Uh, you can wear it uh, just about anywhere in the body. And then you take it off and you wait another 12 hours before you put it on because that gives your body time to repair and rejuvenate. You throw that patch away, you put another one on. 
Uh, for example, you put on a patch at eight o'clock in the morning, uh, you wear it till eight o'clock at night, you take it, discard it, you wait till the next day to repeat it, and you wear it, uh, you can wear more than one at a time, no more than two or three, because after three, two or three patches, you get what's called a, a, a diminishing return. But the bottom line is one patch generally does the trick. And you must drink plenty of water. As Dr. Stroman alluded to earlier, he's a hydration, hydration specialist. So the importance of drinking not only just water, but properly mineralized water, it will actually expedite the benefits of the patch. So imagine a combination of the patch and drinking properly water uh, that's healthy for you would do some phenomenal things. And if you don't think water's important, think about this. Anytime someone goes to the emergency room, the first thing they do is they give the person hydration. They hydrate them because over 90% of the of the people in the world are not do, do not drink enough water. I had to learn that myself as an athlete. I would only usually drink if I'm thirsty, but now I drink with intention and you want to drink at least half your body weight. That would eliminate a lot of other issues that people have in the body of Christ. Now, X39 is so sophisticated, yet simple to explain. Again, just like the sun uh, activates the vitamin D in our God-given body, we already have vitamin D in our body. It's just that we need some stimulation from light. That's called photobiomodulation. The photo is the light, bio is your body. Modulation is the wavelength and the movement of the light within your body. The patch does the same thing. It activates the stem cells through your, your copper peptides. And thus, once that happens again, all kind of things start to get in place. The best thing about X39 is that it absolutely works. It could not get a patent if it didn't work. Now I'm going to shift gears a little bit. I want you to take this site down. It's called thisisitinfo.com. This gives you all the information that you need to know about the patch. If you have any questions, they will be answered on that site. You don't have to do a Google search. You don't have to pray it. If you do pray upon it, pray it and go to thisisatinfo.com and you will get the best information you could possibly find on the X39 patch. Now I'm going to shift gears a little bit. As Dr. Stroman talked about, I'm going to share two testimonies. The first one is going to be a, a bit by video. Uh, uh, it's a gentleman. He's actually a retired uh, law enforcement. Also, he was a veteran, had several issues. And the second is going to be an audio by a gentleman who has some issues. He was probably the worst child abuse case in the history of Long Island. So listen very intently to these testimonies. They're real, they're intent, and they're going to give you an idea of the benefits of wearing these patch. Turning 60 here in a couple of months. I know I don't look it, but he turned 60 and the body really has taken a toll. And I just had my uh, 18th surgery uh, last December on my shoulder, shoulder repair. Uh, I had 17 on my neck and my lower uh, lumbar. The last back surgery I had last year was they put, put two rods in my back. So I've got a neural stimulator, wires running up to my neck. I look like the Terminator on the inside. Um, so I, I was waking up. Uh, I was in pain every day. And I, I didn't for years, since uh, 1998, actually. And then, uh, so didn't know what it felt like to be out of pain. And um, I tried everything. I've done everything from top hospitals, from John Hopkins, to down in Orlando, uh, Florida, and Tampa, Florida hospitals, and doctors, and then everything. And and uh, I tried about everything, acupuncture, you name it, and still um, experiencing pain. And because I've been in Iraq and the things that I did, you know, dealt hard with uh, PTSD. And so my sleep over the years have been very poor. And when I say poor, on an average of two, um, two to three hours a night, four hours was a good night where it was either the pain or reoccurring nightmares. Um, and this has gone on for o over a decade. So uh, a few weeks ago, uh, a pastor told me about the patches. And I said, when he mentioned it, uh, Bishop Larry Jackson, when he, when he mentioned it, I was like, okay, I'm ready. Just send it. And he told me about the stem cells. I, I've heard about that, read about that prior. And uh, and so uh, um, he called Miss Gwen and and uh, got the patches to me uh, about two yeah about two weeks ago. And um, and I put uh, got an example of the X39 
49 and the ocean, uh, ice, um, ocean wave. I think that's what it is, ocean wave. So either way, I took a patch because I was really hurting that night and put it on my lumbar. And <laughs> this is no joke. Uh, 30 seconds after putting that patch on, within 30 seconds, I was feeling no pain. I mean, I'm moving my hips around for like, like I had a hula hoop on, just trying to make the pain happen. And there was no pain. And I, and I, I couldn't, I couldn't believe it. And then, um, but it was true and uh, slept fine. So ever since these last two weeks, and I keep a record on my phone, I have an app for my sleep. Um, and how many hours, you know, what's my um, REM sleep and so forth, how much restful sleep. Prior to these patches, my average time was between an hour and 50 minutes and, and three hours and 33 minutes of getting sleep per night. Since I've had the patches, I'm getting seven and eight hours a night. Um, my PTSD, as far as the nightmares, I haven't had one nightmare in the last two weeks. So this patch is amazing. Um, so amazing that my wife, who's been a, who's an RN for 34 years, she's been dealing with nerve pain um, in, in her legs. Um, she uses it and it's helped her tremendously. So um, that's my story and I'm sticking with it um, because it's true. All right, here's the next testimony. Worse on record case of childhood abuse and they show Long Island in the 1970s. Two of my, my twin brothers, I, they weren't my twin, they were twins with each other, they perished and myself and some other siblings survived and became scattered. As a result, the abuse I sustained, a lot of the abuse that came from pool sticks, it caused over 118 fractures in my body. And the doctors could see the bone spurs, the chips off of the bone everywhere. And as a young person, I became a lot of that, most all of it. As I got older, it brought havoc on me. Every type of rare arthritis that's out there as a result, it seems I got it. My parents would be arrested if they took me to the doctor, so I was left at home for these things to heal. Nerves grew around those bone spurs, and so they cannot be removed now. I have suffered as an adult pain that is indescribable. I have gout. A rare form of arthritis. I have Tietz's syndrome, uh, syndrome, a rare form of arthritis. I have kyphosis of the spine, which is hunchback, meaning my spine will decide to bend on its own involuntarily, and you can feel it as the bones are cracking. Most of the still fight, so when I sit up straight, the bones burst to press on the nerves. And sometimes it would take me until about this time in the evening, between 6 p.m. and now, to be able to sit up or make it to the side of my bed to use a urinal. Now, I usually preface, let me say it now, this is a tale of triumph, not sadness. I today, as the grandfather and a father of two, can now go and visit my kids or hang out with them. And I've only been using these patches for 22 days. After six days, I walked two miles, something I hadn't been able to do in a decade and a half. On Thanksgiving, I visited my 36-year-old son. He is an adult living uh, with a disability, and it's the first time I could visit him on Thanksgiving in 11 years instead of sitting home crying. The pain would be so unimaginable at times that I literally would feel like I was passing out. All I could do was pray. Couldn't even tell you my name at those moments, and I've asked about assisted suicide and everything else because... There wasn't much of a life there. It hurt all over, and it hurt terribly bad. Within three days, I felt very little pain at all, almost none. At six days, I walked two, I walked two miles from the Bronx into Manhattan 
and I never had to sit down once. I never had to stop. I didn't think about it till I was walking over the overpass over the Major Deegan. I've been able to carry my own groceries now instead of having to order them. I've been able to carry gallons and gallons of things so much so I realized I need to chill out a little bit. I'm overdoing it. I took the subway to see my son on Thursday. And I enjoyed the fact here I am traveling to Brooklyn from the Bronx. I'm enjoying it. I didn't take a cab. I decided to walk a quarter of a mile from Utica Avenue to his home and do the same going back. Although my brother, my big brother, Dallas Bell, who is a part of why these patches are in my life, he introduced Miss Paula Pierce, who sent me the patches, and Miss Yvonne Landry, who also sent me patches and got me well in record amount of time. I'm on disability because I haven't been able to work since 1996 for the aforementioned reasons. But today, all I can do every day is thank God I can get up any time I want. I can go without taking the pills because they're PRN and they're opioids. And I can give my kidneys and my blood and my bones a break from the toxins of chemicals. Mm. I can offer to take my name garbage out when I go out when they had to take mine out I keep it in the freezer because I couldn't get them out of here and I didn't like asking but they'd have to get my mail I'm offering to do these things and I'm doing them with ease I haven't felt this good since I was a teenager you mentioned your shoulder uh, I have a torn tendon in the right shoulder I couldn't not only could I not sleep on that side but I, you know, I had such a hard time. I have a $3,800 guitar and I can't even pick it up and hold it because I'm afraid it's going to fall and break. Now I can literally curl and lift weights. I'm doing it within moderation and I'm going to continue doing the other things I, I've been doing. I'm not trying to replace these things, but I'm telling you now it feels impossible. I didn't want to leave my children behind, but I didn't want to live in that constant moment of pain. I couldn't even go to the pharmacist to get my pain meds sometimes for two months because it hurt too much to go get them, ironically. Now I'm forgetting to take the pain medicines at times. So I just want you all to know, everything I do will always come from my spirit, from my soul, with every fabric of my being. My testimony is true to all of you, and I hope to touch some of you so you can understand, yes, I'm 54. I've been through it all. People in my position, we've tried everything everything and you're afraid to set yourself up for disaster because you you tried all the snake oil and everything else the black seed oil and everything sure it helps you but it ain't helped me with what i'm dealing with these patches the x39 are a gift from god god works in mysterious ways this is a mysterious way i didn't have to understand it but it it has made me a new man with a new life and i hope that you all will give it a try and bring it to others who are suffering and God bless you all. Thank you for your time. So that was the final testimony. Now what I like to do is I'm going to actually bring Dr. Stroman back. Uh, he's going to talk about, you know, hydration and certified hydration specialist. I hope this again made sense to you. And we're going to put some links in the chat. Again, this is at info.com. It's a site. to get all information about the stem cells patch. And I'm going to put another link in after Dr. Stroman talks about hydration. So back to you, Dr. Stroman. Uh, you have to unmute. Sorry, Dr. Strom. Back to you. Oh, I'm talking to myself, Derek. Listen, thank you so <laughs> much, Derek. <laughs> Outstanding job. Outstanding job. Outstanding job, my brother. Wow, wow, wow. All right, guys, you got some good stuff from Mr. Hawkins and those amazing testimonies. So let me wrap it up with what I'm going to say, and then we're going to go ahead and let you guys enjoy your beautiful Saturday. I'm going to say this to all of you right now. The Bible is the number one longevity book in the world. There's a lot of stats out there about the future of health. Not going to get into that right now, but that's not, we supposed to be kingdom citizens. And that's not our future. You guys got a bright future, okay? If you follow principles that we talked about today. But let me back up some things that Mr. Hawkins talked about. There's some things in the church that people are affected by, which is one of them, is stress. Stress is one of the most, the biggest health issue in the world. 90% of primary care physicians are saying 
their patients is stress. It's all over the world, even pastors. I have pastors on here right now. We have pastors listening and bishops that I work with are on this call right now, and they will tell you. So let me give you a few things to help all of us to be able to deal with this stress situation. Now, remember, I'm the equalizer. I like to bring the balance. Stress. There's a scripture for that, and there's a patch for that. Proverbs 14.30, a calm, undisturbed mind and heart of the life and health of the body. How about sleep, another epidemic in the church? There's a scripture for that, and there's a patch for that. 1 Peter 5.7, cast all your cares on him, because he cares for you, right? Proverbs 3.24, thou shalt lie down and get sleep, sweet sleep. How about your memory? Dementia, epidemic. I had to take one of my members here in my subdivision to the bank, and she couldn't remember how to get to her own bank that she'd been going to for years. This is serious, folks. Proverbs, how about your memory? Let's talk about that, guys. You don't, you don't want to play Russian roulette with your brain. There's the spiritual side, mental side, and the physical side of your brain. You need to take care of your brain, folks. You don't want to lose that. So in the body of Christ, we still have so many people experience what? Dementia. There's a scripture for that, and there's a patch for that. The scripture, Proverbs 10, 7, the memory of the righteous is blessed. We believe in no, no brain being left behind because we need your brain to carry out your divine assignment. Number four, people losing energy. There's an energy crisis. Are people dragging in, even going to church? They can't worship God. Tired. Okay? Energy and strength. There's a scripture for that, and there's a patch for that. Psalm 103.5, thy youth is renewed like the eagle. Let me tell you something, brothers and sisters. The church is supposed to be the most powerful institution in the world. And we endeavor to get back on track because that's what we're supposed to do. Let me spend a few minutes talking about this deal called hydration. Folks, you have no idea how important this water deal is, some of you. And I've done these seminars for many, many years across the nation doing radio shows and podcasts. Folks, let me tell you something. This thing called an X2O, you can write it down, and Mr. Hawkins will put this website in the, in the chat for you. But X2O, I'm telling you guys, it's a perfect marriage between X2O and these patches. X2O is a tea bag like sachet. You can only find it one place near the Okinawa Island in Japan. Those people live longer than just about anybody on the planet. This little sachet you drop it in your water, cleans up the bad stuff in the water, is transferring your water into alkalinity. But see, you're thinking about alkalinity. This is another level. It also has 70 organic trace minerals. This ain't no normal water, folks. I've seen testimonies globally about this. And you know what's so wonderful about what we're sharing with all of you? I'm sure how awesome God is. LifeWave, the man at the top, is a godly man. Zuma Worldwide, the man at the top, is a godly man. Now, only God can put that together. So back to water. Your body, 90%, 90% of Americans are clinically dehydrated. The hero is water. Many people are walking around with a drought because they don't drink enough water because they say they don't like water. But you like Coca-Cola, and Coca-Cola is destroying your body. Okay, moderation. It's clean. I mean, Coca-Cola is one of the most acidic things you can put in your body. But that's what millions of people are drinking, and it's destroying them because of a lack of knowledge. The Bible says you're captive because you have no knowledge. Now, moderation, you can drink that every once in a while. If you want your cells to be standing at attention, you need to drink this kind of water. Water has what we call life-giving and life-sustaining power. Your cells will be dancing when you got the right water. It affects your DNA. It's an assembly line of your body. You want to get old, don't drink water. The aging process is accelerating because people don't drink enough water. Okay, headaches, fatigue. It's so sad. Many of the drugs people are taking, if they drank water, they would need the drugs. America's the number one in the world when it comes to drugs. And we don't need all those drugs. Now, if you're taking medication, please follow your doctor's instructions. I'm telling you, all the years that I've been in this deal, I've seen too many people come off 5, 10, even 27, almost 30 medications just for making a shift in their behavior. Remember what I said, it's up to you. Okay? So when you drink tap water, which is bad for you, it has large clusters. That's why you're still dehydrated because tap water has large clusters. You, break, you drink X2O, 
you have small clusters. Now your cells are dancing, and that's why, that's how your age is. Don't give me your number, it's your cells. And so what Derek talked about in this water together, it's a game changer. So our goal is to help a million people who want to be saved in this area, who want to live a beautiful life with health and prosperity, vitality, energy. We don't supposed to be suffering like this, folks. Okay, that's not the deal. Something is wrong, and we want to help you in that area. So if you go to zoomapro.com, you can skip the first video. You will see the demonstration about the water. And I'm going to end with some thoughts with all of you that I want to share real quickly with you, and we're going to let you enjoy your evening. And we're going to be available this evening if you want to call us an hour from now and ask any questions or whatever, guys. We got to, we got to help our people. That's what it's about. So my closing thoughts is this. We want the church to get back to Psalm 105, 37. There was not one feeble person among their church. The Bible says tribe, but I just stromanize it and say church. I want to be like Jesus in Acts 10, 38, going about doing good and patching all that were oppressed by bad food system and lifestyle. I hope you caught that. The devil has been using bad food as a weapon of mass destruction to kill God's people for years and we want to put a stop to it. Too much bad health and debt in the church. We need education, not just emotions. Nothing wrong with emotions, but we need education. And one of the seminars that I do is about estate planning, what I call legacy document, because that's an epidemic in the church. We quote these scriptures and not doing what the scriptures are saying, leaving an inheritance and we leave in debt. Something is wrong with that, guys. So I, that's another seminar that I do because guess what? It affects your health. Destroying debt is good for your health. It's good for your relationships. Healing is good, but divine health is better. Let me say that again. Healing is good, but divine health is better. God would prefer that you not get sick in the first place. If you adopt the mentality of prevention, Tell the enemy to get out of your mental kingdom. Tell the enemy, talk back to that joker. Tell him to get out of your mental kingdom because you're not victimized by him anymore, okay? You cannot use prayer as a substitute for good health habits. Guys, you got to get this because many of you say, oh, Dr. Stroman, I need to pray. If you pray over bad health for seven days, you think God's going to bless that? Come on, guys. Don't tempt Christ like that. I said you cannot use prayer as a substitute for bad health habits. Again, folks, it's okay to eat that stuff every once in a while. Moderation is the key. 80-20 rule, it's okay. You need to have a health plan, okay? Because here's what I know. Society does not demand that you exercise. You got to demand that of yourself. Society does not demand that you eat God's food. You got to demand that of yourself. Society doesn't demand that you drink X2O, you must demand that of yourself. Society is not going to demand that you take, you what you wear X39. You have to demand of yourself. And society is not going to demand that you have unforgiveness, bitterness, jealousy, backbiting. That's one of the main spiritual things that's keeping people in the church sick because their spirits are not right. I hope I said that correctly. So you must demand this of yourself. Time to take charge of your health, folks. We're supposed to live in divine health throughout our golden age. All this hospice, wheelchairs, all that stuff, guys. If we took care of ourselves now, we wouldn't maybe face that stuff. Because, again, it's cumulative. If it took you 20 years to mess up your church, give us three months at least. It might happen in a couple of days. But many people want it to be done instantly. I'm letting you know, if it took 20 May, 20 years to destroy your health, I think it's a fair assessment to give us 30, 60, 90 days to get back on track because you're worth it. And here's what I know also. If you want to be strong in the body of Christ, we need healthy bodies to do healthy ministry. Let me say it again. We need healthy bodies to do healthy ministry. The healthy congregation is a powerful congregation. Let me say that one more time. A healthy congregation is a powerful congregation. And one of the biggest nations is procrastination. And procrastination is the assassination of your health destination. You heard information today. It's like a game of chess. It's your move. What are you going to do with it? Are you going to be a professional hearer and an amateur at doing? Is This is the day that you have your breakthrough start taking action. 
not just lip service, but taking action, okay? Because again, it's up to you. We're here, we're just the messages. Derek and myself, we just messages. I'm taking this message around the world. We're gonna be doing a whole bunch of stuff because we have 1 million people. That's just the start, guys, because we're so far behind. So let me give you a declaration and we're gonna close this out and let you guys enjoy your beautiful Saturday. I wanna thank my dear partner, Mr. Derek Hawkins for doing an outstanding job. What a blessing that brother is, okay? And we grew up in Queens together, man. So we go way back, like he said. So this is a divine connection, okay? Now, we're gonna also have holistic doctors working with me on this platform. From time to time, I'll bring holistic doctors to talk about who's a part of LifeWave. They're gonna be talking about the same thing. We got a lot of doctors in LifeWave. So let me give you this declaration that I do when I do a live seminar at the church. I have a billion dollar temple no weapon formed against my health should prosper. God wants me healthy and I will do my part. I have a billion dollar temple. I'm too blessed to be stressed, too anointed to be disappointed. I'm healthy and physically fit. I have a billion dollar temple. I have dominion over junk food. Let me say that a second time. I have dominion over junk food. My body is a masterpiece created by almighty God. I have a billion dollar temple. A long, healthy life is my destiny and my birthright. I have supernatural energy and vitality which helps me to fulfill my divine assignment. I will invest in my health because this is my true wealth. I have a billion dollar temple. I hope all of you can feel what we're talking about today because we want you to live long and to live strong. So God bless each and every one of you. Remember this, failure will never overtake you if your determination to succeed in your health is strong enough. Let's get it done. Join the 2X program. X39, X20, let's get it. Let's do it. Let's go ahead and save our people because we're the only ones that can do it. With that being said, I'm going to turn it back over to my partner. I want to thank all of you guys for listening to what we shared today. We're here for you. If you need to reach us, call us up. We'll talk to whoever you want us to talk to. I do different types of seminars all over the place, so just let us know. Again, live long and live strong. God bless you. Have a wonderful day. Back to you, Mr. Hawkins. Thank you, Dr. Stroman. <clears throat> Can you hear me okay? Yes, sir. You're welcome. Yeah, just in closing. In fact, Dr. Stroman uh, did a great job closing it. I don't, I don't have much to add, but I do like to close with a, a scripture that I like to read and, and, and share. And it's a withhold not good from those to whom it is due when it is in the power of thine hand to do so. Let me repeat that. Withhold not good when it is in the power of thy hand to do so. And what is that we have that is good? It's the X39, X2. We, we found a way to, to, to give us health, to get rid of stress, to get our minds right. Uh, the body of Christ needs all these things. So you want to withhold it, not withhold it from those that you know. Now that you know, you have to share with others. If, if you don't share with others, it's considered selfless. So again, you found and identified and know the information. Um, make sure you share with people that you know and love and care about. Again, you don't want to hold from those that you care about when it's in the power of your hand. If you have it in your hand to do so. So please share this with everyone you know. Take advantage of this information. Uh, information has been put in the chat. I'll leave it up for a few more um, a minute or so so you can go ahead and gather the information. It's, this is it, info.com. That will give you information about the stem cell past X39. If you go to zoomapro.com and you skip the first video, but you go through that, site you would also find out the benefits of mineralized water that helps you heal as well but well, thank you all for your time and your in your and this in this time on particularly on the saturday where as we know saturday is a day that we generally get a lot of our chores and activities done but enjoy the rest of your saturday have a blessed week and we will see you all in the beaches of the world the future of your business is here thank you with wix you get advanced ai